Hello there, everyone. Welcome back. I want to apologize for the delay on these videos. Uh, Monster Hunter World came out. It's a game I'm super hyped for. Uh, I posted one of the streams, the very first stream, actually, uh, on the channel. Um, if it's something big like that, I might post the stream. Let me know what you guys think. I'm not going to just constantly be posting streams, but I wanted to do it for that day. Um, so that's kept me busy, and then, uh, school started back up, so I had to pay a little bit more attention to that. But we're back now! Gonna do some more of this. And also, Undermine's just, eh, they're a little long to record, and, uh, right now I've been a little more excited. Soak me. Okay. I don't know what it does. Uh... Oh, something evil means it's a random something evil. Maybe. So, uh, Lucifer starts with the item something evil. Or, sorry, it says he starts with something evil. I don't know if it's always going to be this. Ow! <laughs> I didn't see those until right then. Uh-oh! Gotta get, uh, reacclimated to my Isaac skills. It's a key factor in victory. Because I don't want more short episodes. I want longer episodes. There's also something else I need to do, which I have neglected the entirety of this series. I haven't I haven't made any thumbnails. Yup, no clue what that does. Uh yeah, I really need to make a thumbnail for this. Um I'm Generally not great at making thumbnails. Because I always want custom stuff. Because, I mean, one... Uh, custom stuff is just the best. Everyone likes custom stuff more. Um, so, like, I'd want to do, like, a picture of me or something. Then got all these art things and all the arts for... And I'm not that good an artist, so... But, uh... That I, I don't, uh, don't matter too much. You know, we're just gonna play some Isaac... These have been doing well enough on their own. What does the towel do? <laughs> okay, you know... No, I said we've been doing well enough on the videos, not in this play. Because this is... Well, frankly, pretty bad. Also, shout out to my cat for having laid on my bed and leaving my room instead of immediately jumping on my computer the second I say a word. I know many, many a video has started with that exact uh, chain of events. Really hope this character can get red hearts. I mean, I probably shouldn't have frivolously gotten rid of all my health. Well, I can't have a uh, range up. Meh. Health up. <gasps> red heart. <gasps> the other half of that red heart. Okay, excellent. This this character is uh, OP. Okay, good. I was about to say, I want to see the demon thing. I want Lucifer's face bearing down on me. You know, for parties and stuff. <gasps> Music! Music. I don't like how that randoms forever. <laughs> Keep at it, buddy! <laughs> Just random the music forever. Uh, yeah, that was the shop, so this is a specialty. Um. Okay, so someone someone mentioned this. I don't know if this actually works. I'm, I'm a little iffy. So, I can fly. Still can fly. Excellent. That was what I was iffy about. Dash. Uh, gross. What's this one? Book of the Dead. Barbal Trolta. I'm going to take this. Helps me stay alive. Excellent game. We got... Uh, bookworm. I was about to say 2020. We don't have 2020. We have... Uh, a sometimes effect of 2020. Sorry, someone sent me a message. I have to see if it's... Nope, doesn't matter. 
That's something I can check later. I didn't know if it was something like I needed to check now. Because it's uh, 3 in the morning. So I wanted to see if it was a now thing or I can check it later. It's a later thing. Dun, dun. Starting with the pentagram. It's really good. I like it. And then getting the books right off. Excellent as well. Did I start with six keys, six bombs, and six, and I didn't even comment on it? Six keys, bombs, pennies. You're slipping, buddy. You're slipping. Gotta, gotta stay focused. Stay focused. Look at all your, <laughs> look at all your satanic imagery. Uh, whoops. Need to put the bomb down properly. The last one I, the last game I recorded was uh, undermined, so I just hit R. All right, got a penny there. You know what would actually be funny? This would be really dumb. But it would also be funny about this character. If you have three sixes, ignoring your stats, in either consumables or HP, if you have three sixes on the board, you get a damage up. Like a one damage up. Think I One, I have no clue how you would code that. But it would be interesting to see it done that way. And no, I'm not the one who's going <laughs> to... Mod idea, you should code it! Nope. I know how to add text to things. That's about the extent of my knowledge when it comes to coding. That's actually a lie. I can code other things, but... I'm not that much of a connoisseur of coding yet. What you got? Oh, a heart. Okay, bye. Oh, another cool thing would be if I always... Like, I had a 0% chance to literally ever get a deal with the angel. That would be cool, too. Or... No, 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 no. You can get a deal with the angel, but the angel attacks you regardless when you walk in the room. That'd be pretty cool for Lucifer. Just thought. <laughs> Once again, no, that one would be easy to code because you just have this character anytime they go in. Uh, there's no bombable because they've already replaced bosses, so they can easily do that. Uh, worthless. I mean, I don't know if it's actually worthless, but I don't want it. You could argue that the Book of Belial's a little bit better. It's our point to blowing up rocks. I did that because I was like, ah, I could get a secret room. Actually, I think I still could. Can you? Ow! I hate the poo guys. They're poo poo. No, they're fine. The bomb poops. I just need to not be standing immediately beside and then walk forward. But that messes with my mojo! Okay, that one. It's on this side. More rooms. Ooh. Ooh. No. No attack. No damage. No damage. I'm really excited for... Repentance. I don't know. I don't remember what the Isaac... The actual Isaac DLC is called. I'm excited for it, though. It's going to be awesome playing it. Because... While I do like the mods... I don't know, is anyone else like me on this? I would much rather play official content than mods, uh, like, any day of the week. I'm, I'm not a big fan on playing player-made content. I love the concept of it, though. You know what? Yeah. Let's take it. I didn't take it a couple runs back. Um, there's nothing... I don't mean this is an insult to this run, but there's nothing mind-blowing that's happened so far. Right, those... I think those can be a problem. Come out here! 
Whatever. Just die. Was that when I was playing Soulless? I think it was. I took a little break. <laughs> that was the other reason I took a little break, was just I, having the problems was frustrating me. Uh, did we go down here? I did. Yeah, it was a small room. The lung could pose problems to me. Ah, oh, bloody hand. All of my evil deeds are closed within my palm. Fear not, though. I'm oh, sorry. Fear not, lest you get on my bad side. Blech. Blech. Excellent. Also, we're going to be... Uh, I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to do... Undermine once every other day. Just because it's it's so hard for me um, to manage like those episodes. They're just really long. And I think I'm going to try out... I'm going to mess up the name. I think it's like... It's the wand one that has been mentioned in the comments a couple times. Um, it's like Noiter or something. Totally butchering the name because I just can't remember it. But uh, I think we're going to do that one instead. Sorry, not instead, but that one as well. Uh, like uh, beside the Undermine ones because... The, the Undermine, while I absolutely love playing it, there's, they've been hitting, like, an hour and 40, and, you know, if it's not for, if it's not a game like Isaac, I normally record 20 to 30 minutes of an episode, so, <laughs> you know, that's, uh, that's a lot, <laughs> and then I'm gonna have another game, um, so I'm gonna try to do three. Once again, this may get delayed and be like every other day. I don't know. Um, if I do it every other day, it'll be the same day that um, Wand Game is. I, I can't remember the name. I'm gonna look it up immediately after this fight because I want to make sure I'm calling it the right thing. But uh, that would be the easiest because that game is i think it's a roguelite i think a winning run is approximately 30 to 40 minutes so like isaac length and instead of you know the hour and a half okay so can i go to my steam i know it begins with n that's all i remember whoops uh n noi Noida. N-O-I-T-A. I probably butchered it. It's in a very, uh, it's a pixel style, but not like a, not to be rude, but not a modern pixel style. It's kind of, <sighs> how do I want to word it? It's a little hard to say it, but I'm just going to say it's a pixel style. It's the easiest way for me to explain it. Um... Because I can't think of anything that, like, is directly similar off the top of my head for the style of it. So, I do have a chance at an angel room now. <laughs> but I haven't played any of it, but I'm pretty excited. And I've been given some heads up. Basically, don't, <laughs> don't do what I normally do. Uh, I am not really careful in games. Uh, much of the time, I'm just like, yeah, 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 I'm smart, I got this. So I don't, uh, like, take the time to read everything carefully. Uh, a lot of my play style is I like to do things based off instinct. Because, uh, personally, that that's how I learn better than just reading, especially in games like that. Or like this, you know, roguelites, because sometimes they're a little too ambiguous. Uh, other forms of learning, I do better. Just give me the raw data. Like, math. Uh, give me the formula. 
and like give me one example of it because obviously if you don't understand how the formula is done like if I just say it's Sigma like your the formula is just you use Sigma oh good you use Sigma well how does Sigma work if you didn't know of course, me being a genius, I know how Sigma works. I'll tell you. I'll tell you when you're older, though. Um, nah, I don't. I'm not gonna place a bomb down. Not gonna take damage. Mm, I don't know what I'm going over here for. What could I find? Uh, I guess I could find a special room. Like, the library? Uh, I don't remember if I've seen the shop on this. Yeah, there's a special room. Do I want to go in there? Yeah, I'll go in there. It's not worth it a lot of the time, but... Oh. Well, with those drops... I shouldn't have done that. Oh, well. Uh, with those drops, it's absolutely worth it. Yeah, I'll just pop it. I don't know if it's better to waste half of a heart effective. I see you. We have to go to septic. There we go. I was like, um, could you open? I would like to go to septic. What you dropping? I don't, oh, sorry. I, I I didn't know if it could have been like a custom hand or like a poison hand or something. What do we got? Burgers. I'm done. Sorry. <laughs> it turns out he wasn't sorry at all. He thought it was hilarious, because he is a... What's the age of that? People mocking that. I don't remember. He's a... I was going to say a prepubescent boy, but... If you've seen me, you've seen how glorious my beard can be. Get hit. Get hit. What do we got? Money. I do like having Bandage Girl here. Okay, what do we got? Mm -hmm. Just a one bopper again. Hmm. Would have thought they'd have more boppers. Put down a bomb. Could get a secret room. No secret room. Could get a... Okay, I was about to say that's the worst payout, but we, we got a pretty decent amount of money. Come on, drop. <gasps> Double hands. Cross the sky. Oh my god. Oh, the locked doors are hard to see. Um, Compost is poopy. All these are pretty mediocre. I don't know what this is. Even more options. There are many, many more options. Okay. I said many, many more. That's not actually what it was saying. Let's take PhD. So our pills can only be good. Let's take a health up pill. Why did I take a health up pill? I don't know. Because I can. I'd like to get my charge rate up. You know, maybe get a maybe get a quad shot. That'll definitely, definitely help my <laughs> that'll definitely help my shot speed go up. Alright, alright. And I'll leave you there. Get hit. Get hit. Also, uh, I want to say thank you to most of the support for getting back on stream. I did get a couple nasty comments. Where it was, well, you don't even stream anymore anyway. It's like, well, I mean, hey, thanks. Thanks. I'm on stream now. Please continue to tell me how I don't stream. 
Uh, don't want that. Don't know what that does. Anything that says shuffle, I'm not, uh... I'm particularly interested in. Well, these guys look horrifying. Are they like toes? What the dickens are you? Oh, okay. I was like, I can't get to you, good sir. Pop it. Pop it, drop it, lock it. Get more bombs. And then you talk about it. Get you... Ow! That's two bombs. I should still get it. Get my sweet item. I want it. I want it and I've gotta have it. That's why Necro Hearts are so good. They're so good! Okay. Gun? I don't want this run to win. Quake shot. Thank you. What's this? Infernal Soul crossover. Is this the Death Star? D666 reroll your soul. Now! <laughs> I have... I, I may have... <laughs> I may have lost this run now. <laughs> Oh, I'm in so much danger. Oh, <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> Remember when I said I want my shot speed faster? And then immediately took something that slowed it down a lot? <laughs> I've got the power. <laughs> I mean, oh, the line stays. Uh. I'm wondering how the, the ray actually... That's... That's really powerful. Yeah, that's actually pretty darn powerful as far as, uh, like, beam-esque... <laughs> Beam-esque weapons go. That's pretty darn powerful. That was super dumb. I thought there was a room over there. I should have just looked at the map. Mm, yep. What's this? Schizophrenia... Oh, uh, that's literal poop. We got my little unicorn. Uh, it's more speed and shot speed. Speed and shot speed. No, I'm going big. Give me something better. 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 Don't remember what this is. Penetrative shot and speed up. Awesome. I have become ridiculous. Um, I don't have any money. I'm very pleased with this run so far. Also, I have butt tons of damage. That's from, uh... Oh, so it's a little bad. Just because it'll penetrate... But I don't think that's too bad, actually. A little hard to see my shadow. I guess having the... Ow. That was dumb. Having the... Having the laser in its own right 
is ridiculously powerful, and I... I don't know if it actually does, but I feel like it scales off my power. Uh, because that is... If, if it doesn't, the laser is way too strong of an item. Because that is doing ridiculous amounts of damage for a passive... Because uh, it's not even like tech where you lose your tears. I think this actually is doing more damage. No, tech is a damage down! Yeah, this laser is awesome. Ooh, secret room. Get a key. Um... Oops. Yeah. Oh, no, that's because it hit all of his segments. I think. Ooh, what's this key? Rare key. Return this to where it belongs. Cool. Okay. Don't judge me, I'm dumb. This is not dumb. This is dumb. I'm sorry, I take everything I've literally ever said my entire life back. I'm sorry for lying to you guys. That is beautiful. Uh, I did not mean to lie. That is not dumb. I forgot. I don't, I don't know when they changed it, but... Am I going to have this skull on my head the whole time? I don't like doing this, but I really should probably. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to put up the whatever it's called. Charge bar. Options. Charge bar. I think that's not necessary, not like necessary, but it's not going to hurt me either. Damn. I was curious if I could kill him in that time. Ooh. Yeah, if I, if I, I like looking at just the face to determine if I can do it personally. Because, I don't know, I just do. I'll take you, I guess. He farts. I don't think there's a point to taking that. Keep hitting him with a laser. <laughs> laser. What we got? I'm walking on sunshine. Whoa. I'm walking on sunshine. I want it. I don't know what it does. No, I want this. I want this. Give me this. Give me more money. Give me money. Wait, hold on. I want these to be a bunch of different colors now. No, use this. Go in here. Might be money. That's not money. That's not money. I need money. Why do I keep sometimes going up to damage? Is there money in here? Give me money. Money? Money? <gasps> money. Money, money, money. Get out of my face. Get out of my face forever. You're not worthy. Pop that. Excellent. <laughs> you know, I, I knew he could do that. I think I lost more hearts than I gained. Sweet. It sucks I used that first though, but sweet still. All right, give me give me the pallet. RGB baby. Give. Thank you. 
<gasps> I can see my face again. I'm going to leave the charge bar there, just in case, though. I'm still not a big fan of it, but... Blah, blah, blah. Oh, I'm so happy. Give me money. Should I have saved it? Uh, yeah. Of course I should have. Do I care? No, not really. I'm a lazy person. Like, like... <laughs> I actually, I've talked about this to employers and stuff. And, and I'll say it, like, to pretty much anyone's face. Um, I, uh, my greatest strength in working is that I'm a lazy person. Everyone's like, that's not a strength. And I'm like, nah, dude, that is literally one of the greatest strengths a person can have. Besides being passionate about what you're doing, being lazy is one of the greatest strengths you can have. Um, obviously, I'm simplifying it because there are more functions, but being... Oh, yeah, I'm going to kill myself. Oh, I'm going to kill myself with this. Um, but being lazy is so strong because I don't want to spend any more time on projects. I want them all done. <sighs> God dang it. It's not going well. Um, yeah, just the... Yeah, we'll go in here. Just the sheer fact of I don't want to spend any unnecessary time on the project. What does this do? Oh, awesome. Awesome. Gonna put a bomb down here and here. Full health. Excellent. Uh, we've seen the vital rooms. <laughs> but yeah, like... Uh, I had I had some employers be like, that's not a good thing. And I'm like, no, you, you don't understand. It's literally like the best thing an employee can be because because I'm lazy, I'll get it done right the first time. I'm not doing it a second time. So, like, I... <laughs> and, and that's where, like, laziness versus, like, not having, um... What I want to say, not... I'm not going to word it right, but basically having zero drive. Like, I don't want to do the work, and being lazy are two different things. I'm gonna take this one. I know I, I try to usually alternate, but... Yeah. If I can get back down to zero hearts and get some good spirit hearts... Yes, I could have taken it there. Or just get to half a heart. But, yes, I could have, like, forcibly gotten myself there. But I genuinely don't feel comfortable with my HP. So I'm not doing that. Uh, I will look for ways to do things more efficiently. Because I want them done as quick as possible so I can be lazy again. And for some of my bosses, they've been very accepting of it, and others have just been, like, turd munchers about it. Because they're like, uh, yeah, if you get all your work done, you can just sit there, I don't care, you got all your work done. And I'm like, sweet! Get all my work done in, like, half the time they said, and they're like, why aren't you doing more work? And I'm like, I'm done! Oh, do this person's job. Nope. Next day, take ten times as long. I'm not gonna do extra work. Because I did it, you know, in a more efficient way. Like, uh, so I worked at, uh, the waste treatment facility. I worked at the dump. Um, and we had to, like, sort out some stuff. Okay, whatever, don't care. Um, the one, the, the person there was just an idiot. The boss... He never did anything unless it was, like, the quote-unquote fun stuff. So, like, he would run the, like, machines and stuff, but then he would just sit there on his computer all day. And I know what you might be saying. Well, hey, if he's running it, maybe there are some important... Th no. Literally was on, like... I'm not gonna say Craigslist, but... Uh, he was, like, looking up just stuff for himself. 
and then he would get mad when I'm sitting on my phone reading. And he's like, why aren't you doing anything? And I was like, there's one, one bottle out there. I'm not going to go out and touch it. I'm not going to walk out and do anything with it. No. Wait, hold on. <laughs> one. One. What one's one? Oh, did I just fail it? Yeah, I think I just failed it. Oh, well. That stinks. That stinks. Not about health, though, because I can actually get to that half red heart I wanted. Yeah, so that was, like, how he treated it, and it was awful, because he, he li I mean, literally, it's like, if you finish all your work, and I'm like, yeah, uh, he would constantly make people wait, because he was on the phone just talking with people, um, chili con carne, I don't feel so well, all right, he was overall, like, He's not the employee, but he was an awful employee. That one's good. I'm gonna die soon, I think. How does this work? I don't know how this works. Maybe it doesn't. Whatever. Yeah, because he would constantly ignore people and then he would uh demand that i like take care of other things and i got customers very mad at me customers whatever you want to call them because specifically told it was not my job to handle other people's trash so i do not handle your trash i like help sort things um, and other things you need to take it out of your car like if something if something gets blown out yeah then it's my job to take care of it but if you are just being lazy i don't have to take care of your trash um so the problem with that being is that he had friends who didn't want to take care of their trash. So he would, he'd be like, Hey, you have to go help them. And I was like, no. Um, if, if an old lady is there, I ask her if she would like some help or if someone looks like they're hurt, if it's, you know, someone I know, whatever you can argue, that's not fair. It's not, I don't have to be fair about it. I'm literally doing it on my own volition. I don't have to be fair. Uh, but, like, I had people who... I always hated this, too. Because they would just come in. Sit in their car and smoke and, like, not say anything. And they're like, why aren't you taking care of the trash? And it's like, I'm not going to. You take care of it. Well, I saw you take care of that old lady's trash. Uh-huh. It's an old lady. I felt like helping her. You're a douche. I'm not helping you. Well, it's your job. No, it's not. And then, unfortunately, the boss man would do the greatest sin, and he would change how the rules are. Uh, so he was always fluctuating, like, what I was allowed to do. And then, and demanding I do, like, other works. Which I tell you, I did not, I was not fond of. I tell you, I tell you what. But, that was, uh, he, that's how he wanted things to be done. Because he wanted final say on literally everything. Um... Because it, I don't know, I guess, I guess his pitiful ego needed that help. 
Like, uh, what, probably, uh, so, I got sick one day. Like, really sick. I don't know what it was. I, I guess it was like, uh, I didn't sleep well for a couple, like, a couple nights, and I'm talking like less than an hour of sleep each night. I just didn't feel good. So I was sick. Uh, I almost passed out there. And... What's this one? Full health? That's worthless. Or it's effectively worthless. It's not technically worthless. So if I get more hearts, it's worthful. It's worth something again. But he... <sighs> So, the boss sent me home, because I was sick. Um, he had a very scummy system where... Ah, oh, crap! Oh, boy, that's bad. Where, if you called out sick, you got put on the bottom of the list for work. Sorry, if you not, even, not if you called out sick, just period. Because they didn't have a lot of uh, positions available. Um, and he literally, like, basically was threatening the employees with hours. Because if you called out sick, you would not get hours until the... Uh, or, sorry, you'd be cut down to one day. The place is only open three days. You'd be cut down to one day of eight hours per week. Um, so by doing that, he basically was threatening the employees, come to work sick or you get no hours. So I was sick. I was expecting to drop down to one day. I don't know where that charge went, but whatever. Uh, so I was expecting to get cut down days. You know, that's fine. Uh, I called out sick. Um, for three months, he did not give me a single shift. Sorry, he called in one day on the day of my shift ten minutes before, and I had to help someone. Uh, yeah. At this point, I want to get rid of my heart. Ceremonial dagger. Play with your own life. Infested, baby. Excellent. Um... So, he would, like, keep threatening about it, and it was awful. Or so, so, he was, like, basically threatening, but he was never, like, clearly threatening. So, three months, I had literally no shifts, so I filed for unemployment. Because, uh, clearly, I don't work for him. And if not, I haven't worked in three months. It's called, uh, I believe it's called partial unemployment, where if you're not making enough hours, you can file for it. So I filed for it, and he's like, no, he's still an employee. He can't have it. So we actually had to... He, he fought it really hard, and we had to go into, like... Not a debate about it, but we actually had to, like, get a government official involved to mediate the situation so that they could decide on the final decision. So the person was asking questions. Also, the mediator was awful. Because the boss lied about things, and I corrected him, and the and the mediator was like, "Let him speak." And it's like, okay. Or sorry, he he was not that he was, he's like I don't remember when they were hired. I think they were hired like, and he said like a month ago, and I'm like, that's not true. I have pay stubs, dip, dip shit. Um. But the mediator, like, actually got mad at me. And I was like, okay, I won't say another thing. Uh, wh when is the person's birthday? Uh, I think it's in, like, May. No, my birthday's in September. So he was constantly getting crap wrong. It was it was stuff like that where it'd be like, no, actually, my birthday is in... It wasn't the birthday. I, I don't remember. But it was stuff that I could clarify. He's like, well, I think it's this. Uh, so we had a document handed to us. Um... And ooh, the you'd think that they would be smart and polymitosis. I'm terrified. <laughs> I 
Uh, but you would think that the... Uh, the person would keep the paper on him. He did not. He didn't even have it open. So, I had to listen to him constantly providing false information. And then have... And then the mediator asked me about all of it, and he's like, uh, well, that's not what he said. And it's like, well, you're right. He's wrong. Look at the document in front of you. It tells you when I started work. Because he submitted it. So he lied either on the official document or in the official hearing. Which would you like to get him on? Uh... Actually, I think this mitosis thing doesn't work effectively. I don't know. So, yeah, it was very frustrating dealing with that. And it got to the point where he... <laughs> the boss literally thought he won. He was like... Because he was asking, he's like, Well, uh, did he call out sick that day? And he's like, Yeah! He didn't have a right to it. And I was like, You took me home, dum-dum. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Well, I don't know if he was actually sick. You sent me home. It's it's in your file for why I went home. Would you like to provide them that you just lied again to them? So then it came to the final one. Oh, also, the, the mediator was fine with letting him interrupt me the whole time. But I couldn't interrupt. So that also got really irritating. But... So the, the, the final question was basically asked. It was like, would you give him more shifts? No, why would I? Okay. Uh, he's awarded unemployment. What? It's like, yeah, you literally just said you won't give me shifts. That means I'm fired. Or let go or whatever you want to say. He was like, well, he knew the deal. And it's like, apparently you didn't. That's not how the law works. Because you don't feel like having me work. I'm still your employee. I still need to be paid. I mean, I my life's fairly simple because I live with my parents. But th th I'm just imagine, three months without a paycheck, and then some dum-dum is like... It's not like you need money. Uh, he also wouldn't give me my, uh, my share of things because he wanted more. Um, for the, like, cans and stuff, the town said that they have to, or sorry, not for cans, but for, like, not recyclables, but things like aluminum and stuff, um, I needed a cut out of that. I'm absolutely gonna lose this fight, I think. Yeah, that, uh, polymitosis thing is awful for this. Damn. I think I missed my opportunity to get one last hit in. Which I think would have killed him. Hey, we won. Let's go. Yeah, so ultimately we got it handled and I, I won the case and I got my unemployment. I got like three months back pay immediately, which was ridiculous. Oh, they also don't have, in, they didn't have insurance. Ew. Yeah, so that's why he fought it so hard, but... He could have just fired me and let me go with my life. And then bef and then when I tried to get my, like, checks, uh, he, had, like, uh, he tried to, like, triple charge my family and was really nasty to them. He was an awful dingbat. But, thank you very much for watching and listening to that story. We'll be back in the next step. Question of the day because I forgot. Literally at the end. Um, <laughs> uh, have you ever had any of uh, any of those kind of disputes at a job or even uh, schooling? You know, like, it's clear you're not in the wrong, but they just won't listen. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.